So here we go, I am just putting in the new indicator, LED indicator bulbs. So I've just had to swap the, the flash unit for a different one. So this is the new one uh, and because of course you get fast flashing if you try and put not enough, not enough, if there's not enough load to be able to have a different flashing unit, which comes with the kit. So there you go. So uh, if we turn it on, I've done the left side. So that's what that looks like. Uh, let's try it with the lens on. That's all right, isn't it? Uh, they're quite bright, they're too bright to look at with the naked eye, to be honest. So that's good. Here we are. So it's the rear one, we put that on. So that's how that goes. Of course, I've got to do the right hand side. I've got to do something about the repeater lamp on the dash as well because I don't think it will. Yeah, that's what happens if you leave the repeater lamp behind on the dash. <laughs> uh, they get a little dim, a dim light. So I've got to do something about that. But I think we're on our way. Um, I'll screw this side together and try and do something about that. See There you go. Just go through the back and that's it. And then I've got to sort out this. I've had to disconnect to remove the dashboard repeater lamp. And I need to put in a couple of diodes or something. But that's not urgent. I just want to look inside that head shell, head, headlight bucket as well to see what's, which was some corrosion in there and stuff. It's going to be pissing right tomorrow again, so I'm trying to do all this now. And it's already middle of the afternoon. Um, lovely blue sky at the moment, but we've got a weather warning for severe winds, a weather warning for severe rain again, like we need more rain, which we don't. So, we'll press on with Wardless and um, I'll see you later.